Hey everybody, it's Kit Kat. Welcome to my channel. Um, thank you for joining me. Um, if you are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you are not new and you have been watching my videos previously, thank you so much for joining me again. I definitely appreciate it. Um, I love it when people tell me they watched my videos and what they thought of it. So definitely if you watch this one, go ahead and leave a comment down below and let me know what you thought. Um, if you are new, I do unboxings and reactions. I haven't done too much reactions recently. It's just because like um, a lot of stuff has been happening. So I haven't filmed a lot recently. So I have like boxes I have to catch up on. So I'm trying to do that first because I would like to unbox it with everybody just because um, I do get some really amazing boxes that I would really really love to share with everybody so yeah so this is gonna be an unboxing if you couldn't tell by the title and it's gonna be for one of my all-time favorite boxes ever that is not an exaggeration at all like I love this box so much it's an expensive box too it's not cheap it's definitely not cheap at all um but it's worth it in my opinion um so yeah so we're gonna go ahead and unbox fairy loot i'm so excited so so excited um i will not be talking about like pricing and everything in this one um i have talked about in previous fairy loot videos but if you do want to know more about it you can check out my description below there will be a link and i will put the pricing down there also so um if you haven't watched my other fairy loot videos fairy loot is a book subscription box so they sent a like special edition and when i say special edition like these books are like freaking gorgeous like, mm, like i can't i i'm so like careful with them because i don't want to destroy the book but they send special edition and books with autographs from the authors so you get that on top of bookish bookish goodies so other things that come with books um they do have their own like tarot card sets and they usually send a bookmark and everything with it and the book comes in its like own bag like protective bag thing like a fairy loot branded bag so it's super awesome so we're gonna go ahead and open it because i've been waiting so long so this is the um january fairy loot box um usually the reason that it comes in the next month is because they ship that month's box at the end of the month or even like further into the month so it were into the next month i should say into the next month sometimes so you usually get it the next month um obviously i'm opening it super late so late i'm just excited though i'm excited to open it and i was like i have to open it before they do their um every box they have a thing on instagram where um you basically post photos there's prompts you post photos of what you got in the box and it, it's usually like four so you have to do it for four four different prompts and if you complete all of them within a specific time so they have like a time limit and it's, usually you have like more than a week to post all of these photos you get entered to win a free fairy loot box which is totally worth it in my opinion and plus you get to like practice taking super aesthetic pictures because some of these people that post pictures of their stuff in their box are like like their photos are so gorgeous and i'm just like i'm just trying to take a nice picture like i don't even know like where do they have all of this stuff to take amazing like fabulous pictures of books i have no idea but anyways we're gonna go ahead and open the box because i want to open up and I did want to show this they have this quote on the box and then it says those who don't believe in magic will never find it and I totally subscribe to that saying because I believe in magic and I feel like if you don't believe in magic your life is just kind of boring I guess and then that's the inside of the box which is absolutely gorgeous and then there are the items oh I'm the card sorry this would be the card that tells us about the theme so we're gonna put that down so you always get this amazing art and if you can't tell by the picture it is greek mythology so greek mythology is the theme for the january box okay and it does have like the spoilers so it has all the stuff and on the bottom it also um tells you about the feature book and 
what it was inspired by and everything like that so i'm gonna put this aside because i'm gonna need it and i already see something that i love on the top what it's a wooden spatula like a look at that look at that This is good quality too, now that I'm feeling the wood. This is good quality. Uh, for those who don't know or haven't watched any of this videos, I do bake. I sometimes cook, but I mostly bake. This would be more like a cooking tool because it's not like round spoons or what you would use for like cooking, for like mixing stuff. But I do also still like cook. I have been doing a meal prep program, but I'm going to start cooking again. So I'm like super excited with this, but I don't even... I don't know if I want to use this. It's so pretty. Oh my god. Okay, so let's look at this one card. Um, so this says this is of course a wooden spatula designed by at K D Pletters. K D P L E T T E R S. And it says, um This features a quote from Lovely War by Julie Berry. So that quote I'm gonna be so did you know food is infinitely more scrumplicious or scrum scrumplious when you're in love this says scrumplious right i'm not i'm just saying I'm just, i think that's what it says guys okay so we're gonna put that inside um and i can't like i'm gonna rip about everything in this box so i apologize this is gonna be a long video guys i'm so sorry i feel like this is a what is this this is like a We're trying to figure out what this is. Is this the okay? There's it does say book sleeve. Is this the book sleeve? Is this the book sleeve? Sure, let's try to look at it. I'm, I'm guessing so because I don't see anything else in this box that would suggest it's a book sleeve. So it says, um, inspired by Cersei by M Madeline Miller. We present to you a brand new book sleeve. It features a design by at Chatty Nora, C H A T T Y N O R A, um, and it basically says carry your mythology tomes around in style. It's thick. Like, do you see the lining? Do you see the lining like inside of there? Like, it's it's really thick. Okay, and there's a quote. Um, I'm assuming from the book, so it says, "But in a solitary life, there are rare moments." When mother, when another soul dips near yours, as stars once a year brush the earth. That's. I need to read this book. I haven't read this book, but I need to read it now. Like, that's an amazing quote. I love that. This is. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna put books in it to be honest, but it's like. I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna use it for. Okay. We're gonna put that on the side, but this is gorgeous. This is very well made too. Um, next thing I have, okay, I see Cupid and Psyche, trinket tray, okay, let's, hold on, I got my scissors, we got our scissors here, oh, oh wait, no, I think I got it both sides, just a moment while I try to figure out how to open things, because I'm gonna, did I not cut it, oh, I did, okay, um, hmm, how does this open now? I am confused. It is confusing. Oh, I got it. I got it, guys. Oh. What? I'm like afraid that I'm gonna like hurt this thing. Look at that. Look how gorgeous. Oh my god, I don't know if you guys can even hear me. I'm like whispering in reverence of this. And it does have the branding for Fairy Loot on the back. But this is gorgeous. Okay, says this, of course, this says stunning. They're absolutely right. Stunning trinket dish featuring Eros and Psyche from the legendary love story between a mortal and a god. And this beautiful illustration is by Tarot Jaw. Um, I'm not, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. I apologize if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but, um, it's spelled T-A-R-A-T-J-A-H. Um, 
I'm gonna go ahead and link all of the or try to link all of the artists if I can find them down below so you can go ahead and check them out if you really really love their art which um I'm all about supporting artists so if you like the art go ahead and show them love support them on their page and everything but yeah I'll have the links down below because this box is like I'm gonna be honest though I'm blown away by every single fairy loot box so what I don't even want to put anything on this it's so pretty like what 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 I want to Put anything on there for okay i'm guessing so there is a, it says in yeah it is medusa i didn't read the spoiler but <laughs> see so this is an iron on patch which displays medusa of course beautifully illustrated by um Al aliesa's world i don't know if i pronounced that correctly. oh my god like i'm so sorry if i'm pronouncing these things wrong the it's spelled A L Y E S A S World, um, but yeah, look at that. If that isn't like absolutely gorgeous, wow, wow, that gold. I don't know if you can see in the camera, but that's like gold stitching right there. The whole thing is gold stitching. Okay, so it is an iron-on one. I don't know what I want to iron it onto though. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to think about that. But I definitely want to keep this because I love I love Medusa. She's a badass. She's badass. And if you don't know the true story about Medusa, go look it up. Cause Medusa's a tragic story and she didn't deserve what she got. But it's okay, she turned up to stone. So Medusa's a badass bitch to me. So we're going to put her away carefully. I don't want her to get ruined. Um, oh, wait. There's more. There's more. It says metal bookmark on here. I'm going to... Oh, it's hard to open. Ah, I left my, my sword letter opener on the table. Why? I didn't think I was going to need it, guys. I didn't think I was going to need my... They should have, like, had, a, like, a warning. Like, you, you should have your other box items from last month prepared to help you open <laughs> the contents of this box. Ah! Okay. Is this Athena? Hold up. This is, this is Athena. I freaking knew it as soon as I saw this is gosh look at her freaking warrior goddess like I knew it was like Athena Athena because she is the warrior goddess okay so this is done by mono lime art at m-o-n-o-l-i-m-e art and of course picturing Athena goddess of war and Wisdom. Well, I wouldn't say war, but she is like a warrior goddess. Yes. She's a badass too. I'm loving this. I'm loving. Oh my god, this is this is so gorgeous. Look at that. I don't want to like wow, that's um I'm like blown away and even though this box costs a lot of money. I feel like all of this stuff is totally worth it. Like, do you see, like, the quality of the stuff that they give you? It's freaking amazing. Okay, let me see what else there is. Okay, and then there is an uh, art print. So, art print inspired by Percy Jackson. So, this art print is done by at ARZ28, ARZ28. And that is really gorgeous, if you ask me. I love I love how they envision the characters. Very, very pretty. We're gonna put that on the side and we're not gonna damage it. And then um like I said earlier, they always give tarot cards. So these are the two. So we got four of wands and three of wands. So that's our three of wands. And then that's our four of wands. She's gorgeous. Wow, she's absolutely gorgeous. He's gorgeous too. Let's be honest, they're both gorgeous. Wow. Love it. Okay. This part of the books. 
the book. I'm pretty sure that's it. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna put that on the side. Okay. So feature book of the month is Lore by Alexander Bracken. Okay. I'm gonna slowly, we're gonna slowly pull this out. We don't wanna. Okay. So they always give art based on the book. And it also has a letter written by the author. So I will read that later, but very gorgeous art. Always, always love the art. And then um, this art print is by at Running Quill Art. So it's going to be Running Q U I L L underscore Art that did this one. So we're going to put that on the side. I'm, I'm not going to show you guys the book yet. I'm going to open my fairy scoop. So this is the fairy scoop. And then um, on the box, back, sorry, box, what? the back, it has um, the information for the box photo challenge. So it has the dates and everything. And then it tells us what we're going to be taking pictures of. But I like to wait till they post on Instagram to like get a better idea of like how other people are taking pictures of it because I'm just not good at taking pictures of inanimate objects I don't know why I love taking pictures of stuff but I'm just not good at it so I like to take inspiration from other people and then this basically the face group has an interview with the author so there's that and then also tells us what the next month's theme is so February theme basically which I'm gonna get the box this month in March um, that's the theme what the future holds so we're gonna put that on the side and we're gonna I'm loving this like cover. Okay. It's like minimalist but gorgeous, okay? So the, it looks like marble and like gold. If you haven't watched any of my videos, and if you can't tell by my makeup, I love shiny things. Love shiny things. So when I get stuff like this, oh even the bottom. And then it's this wow. That's snakes, that's gorgeous. And then the back it says hunt or be hunted and it has Medusas. This is the story about Medusa. Okay. Oh, on the front it says the games have begun and she's playing for her life. Okay, let's see what the, um, oh, that's right, they have, wow. Okay, so it's like a yellow, like mustardy color, the pages. Like, the, like, last month it was like a gorgeous red. Oh my god, I couldn't even die. But this has like a print. Oh, that's, that's gorgeous. Um, I am Year of the Snake. So I actually love snakes because I am the Year of the Snake in the Chinese Zodiac. Um, oh, hold on. So I love anything with snakes. I should wear my snake ring this. I did, if I had known, if I had known. I would have worn my snake ring, but I didn't wear it this time. Um, but yeah, that's gorgeous. What? 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 Okay, and then we're gonna look on the inside. Ooh, that's pretty. I love this. I love this. And I'm gonna see if what page they have. Oh, she signed this page. So they always have autograph. And then the inside cover usually has art. This one does. So there that is. And it's freaking fabulous. Okay, and then this dust jacket art is done by Atlas Art Sardonyx. I apologize if I'm saying that super wrong. Um, but it's at L I Z Z A R T underscore Z A R. D O N I C Z. I will link that down below because that's a long one. Um, but that's gorgeous. That's pretty. Look at her with Medusa shield. Yes. This looks like it's set in like a modern world, but like with Greek themes. Um, I kind of know a lot about Greek mythology because I love like ancient mythology, especially involving like the ancient pantheons, like Greek. The Greek pantheon, Norse, Norse pantheon, um, Egyptian pantheon. Like I love like all of that kind of stuff. Like I used to just read it on my own. Um, but yeah, that is the Fairly Box for January. And I'm so excited to start reading this. 
I'm excited and I don't know like if I want to use that metal that metal bookmark is too nice that's like a display like you display it I don't even have a place to display it I'm gonna figure out how I can display it because that's a display item um but yeah I hope you enjoyed this unboxing with me as much as I enjoyed unboxing it because let's be honest I pretty much like freaked out about everything in the box it was um a uh, Feilu, let me just say this, Feilu never, ever, 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 ever disappoints. I, I always love my Feilu box. It's always amazing. It's the best. Love it. Can't get enough of it. We'll always get this box. This is the box. This and my City Club are the two boxes that are on my list that I will never stop getting. I will always get them. No matter how broke I am. Which I'm pretty broke right now, so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm still gonna get it. But yeah, I hope everybody is doing well. I am smart. I can't believe it's. Can you guys believe it's March already? Um, I am waiting. I'm an essential worker, so if you don't know, I do work a full time job. Um, so I do just why sometimes I don't have time to film because I'm like filming in between like actually working and like being an adult and doing adult stuff and having responsibilities. Um, but because I'm an essential worker, I am. We are working towards getting us at my workplace all vaccinated so I'm waiting for that I don't know how it is in other states or countries in Hawaii right now they're still kind of doing like the high risk and like super frontline workers like nurses and doctors and stuff we're hoping like more into spring that I will be able to get my vaccine but I hope everybody is doing well and staying safe and you know we're we're getting there i feel we're getting there to having the world open up a bit more again so i'm excited for that and yeah um if you haven't watched my previous video the video before this i am having a giveaway so go ahead and check it out and i hope to see you in my next video if you like this go ahead and hit that like button subscribe if you would like to see more and i really do hope i see you in future videos and oh my god my cat's gonna step on my art no, Junior. No. No. You can smell, but please don't step on stuff. Thank you very much. Sorry. Junior distraction. That's what happens when you have pets. Um, yeah, I hope to see you in future videos. And thanks for joining me for this one. Take care. Bye.